Are you looking to maximize the benefits of CO2? Well, the answer is clear and simple. Simple CO2 is an inexpensive, easy, and by far the most effective method for arranging CO2 tubing. By suspending CO2 tubing in a position that is between both the lighting system and your plant canopy, Simple CO2 is the only product that allows for 100% of your CO2 to be released directly above your plants. Simple CO2 will permanently stick to the lighting system and will never have to be replaced. It is made with a heavy duty material that is virtually impossible to break and will even help protect your glass and bulb if your reflector ever falls from the ceiling. Simple CO2 maximizes the amount of CO2 reaching your plant canopy, resulting in higher yields than previous methods. Simple CO2 ensures that you are achieving the ultimate results during the small amount of time your CO2 is released. Research has proven that CO2 enrichment should take place directly over the upper third portion of your plant canopy because this is where photosynthetic activity is at its peak. Simple CO2 is the only product that allows the CO2 to be released from this optimal location. Plants will consume all the CO2 around their leaves in a matter of minutes and simple CO2 allows for the gas to be readily available when the plants are ready to consume more. Simple CO2 is absolutely, well, simple and each reflector can be set up with the simple CO2 system in less than 10 minutes and does so in a manner that will not harm any plants that may be currently growing. Ideally, you will need 8 pieces of simple CO2 for normal size reflectors and 10 pieces for large side reflectors. This will allow for the tubing to be neatly framed directly underneath the reflector. Each piece of simple CO2 has an ultra strong and permanent adhesive that will allow it to stick to any size and style of reflector. If needed, you can turn the simple CO2 piece and stick it to the side of your reflector. Simple CO2 will work just as well with the holes at the side as opposed to the bottom. Remember, simple CO2 uses an ultra strong and permanent adhesive to withstand extreme grow room temperatures. So take your time when attaching the pieces for the first time. Don't stick the pieces too close to the corners, for this will allow the CO2 tubing to easily make the turn. Before removing the aligner from the pieces, visualize where you want to place them so they are evenly spaced. The holes in each piece should be facing downward, and the sticker on each piece should be on the outside. Once the adhesive liner is removed and you attach the pieces to the reflector, give each piece two to three firm squeezes. Since CO2 is heavier than air, once the gas is released through the tiny holes in the CO2 tubing, it will then fall through the openings in the bottom of each piece. Each piece is also open at both ends thus allowing for the CO2 to also release from the sides. Figure out which side of your reflector is closest to the location of your CO2 tank and that is the side where, we, where you will start feeding your CO2 tubing through the simple CO2 system.
by arranging the CO2 tubing on the side of your reflector closest to your CO2 tank. This will ensure that the link between the tank and the simple CO2 system is as short as possible. You will need a quarter inch CO2 tubing, the kind of tubing that is drilled with the tiny holes already in it, and you also need regular quarter inch vinyl tubing. The CO2 tubing will be run through the simple CO2 pieces, resulting in the tubing being neatly framed directly underneath each reflector. Use a quarter inch barbed T connector to connect the two ends of the CO2 tubing. Next, use the regular non-drilled tubing to connect your CO2 tank, the regulator on your CO2 tank, to the simple CO2 system. By using regular vinyl tubing between the tank and the simple CO2 system, this will ensure that 100% of your CO2 will be released directly above your plants. No matter if you have one light or 40 lights, you can use a quarter inch barbed T connectors to link all of your lights in a clean and organized manner. When linking reflectors together, make sure and leave plenty of slack to prevent the lights from pulling on each other when they are raised and lowered. Simple CO2 eliminates the high percentage of wasted CO2 associated with previous methods for arranging the CO2 tubing. Simple CO2 is the only method that allows for 100% of your CO2 to be released directly above the plant canopy. Simple CO2 is a major improvement on the ceiling ring method of arranging tubing. Once released, CO2 moves slowly and not very far, so it is not ideal to release CO2 so far from your plant canopy. With all the clutter already suspended from the ceiling of your grow room, it is very difficult to set up the ceiling ring. Also, even if you do find, figure out a way to arrange the ceiling ring, you will still have your reflectors in the way blocking the gas from having a clear path to the plant canopy. If you're using the ceiling ring method for your CO2 tubing, ditch the ring. Some growers choose to stick their CO2 tubing in a fan and have the fan blow the CO2 all around the room. Don't blow your pricey CO2 all over the room when it's only beneficial above the upper third portion of the plant canopy. Using a CO2 tank and regulator is the most expensive form of CO2 enrichment, and simple CO2 releases the maximum amount of CO2 directly above your plants. If you are using the fan method for your CO2 tubing, forget the fan. So use simple CO2 and your plants will grow like a champion today.